the Reports tab. The Reports tab is where you will go for all information needed for grants and internal data sets. Reports are built in conjunction with your Newark implementation staff member. Therefore, this video is to demonstrate how you run these reports. All reports, though, generally run the same way. The fields that go into these reports come from all those that you've created with your contacts, donations, and events. These are tailored to each organization. Begin by clicking on the Reports tab. Along the left-hand side, you will have Report Groups that stores reports within them. These report groups are customizable. You open up the report group by clicking on the plus sign to see these reports. Choose a report you want by clicking the blue report writing of the report in question. If there is no search criteria set for the report, it will run the report as soon as it was clicked. However, in most cases, a report search box will appear. The search criteria varies for every report depending if it is an event, contact, or donation-based report. Once you have set all the criteria you need, click the Find button to run the report. When the results come up, you'll be looking at the List View tab. This view will be based off the field names created on which you and your new org implementation staff member agreed upon, thus is customizable to reporting need. If reports are grouped, for example by event type, names or dates, etc., you'll be able to have counts on a number of those groupings. Also, if fields are number-based, we can do totals, counts, or averages. Along the top, you will see tabs if the report is grouped. When you initially run the report, you will be in the List tab. The Summary tab will show you a list of the groupings and any counts or totals that were calculated in that list. The bar chart will give you a visual of these totals. And the pie chart will give you the percentages of the groupings. If you wish the report to be regrouped by a field displayed in the report, you have a Grouped by dropdown on the list tab. Choose the field from the dropdown and then click the Resubmit button. Once regrouped, you can look at the Summary, Bar, and Pie tabs for that regrouping. If you wish to export the results to Excel, click on the Excel icon button. And then choose from the Excel drop-down, Comma Separate. Then click the Export button. This will process the report. Once processed, click the Download Report button below the List tab, and then click the Open button to complete the process. To print the report in New Word, just click the Print icon next to that of the Excel. This will bring up a print preview, so you can review before clicking the Print button. It is also important to know that specific reports can be located on the left column of any main tab of New World. This is all for the Reports tab video.